All right, YouTube. Uh, maybe I'll get this video right this time. Previous video had me uh, tearing apart the back of my car to show you how to get the uh, suspension, air suspension uh, module out, where it was, how to get it out without destroying your trunk or cargo area. But um, I found something else. I have a N151 solenoid, and I think they're numbered one. 48 to 151 the for the four the four corners Each strut is going to have a number and then the solenoids the solenoids that open and close each strut for the air Is going to have a number and if you're having this problem and you're doing research you're probably familiar with these numbers If not just ask and I will elaborate a little bit, but there's plenty of information on Audi forums and YouTube anyway I've been poking around Hopefully I didn't destroy my computer when I took it out and looked at it. But um, I put a new solenoid block in here because I figured that was the problem. And pretty much everything uh, on the internet was saying replace that solenoid. So, but it wasn't. It didn't fix the problem. But I'm going to show it to you anyway. So there's my uh, brand new solenoid up in there. All pretty. Hopefully it doesn't leak. But... I did uh, replace this like two days ago and it didn't fix the problem. So I'm poking around and uh, by stroke of million dollar luck, I'm poking around up here at my compressor. And you may, I um, hope you can still see it as well. I'm poking up here at my compressor and I look just above it. And you see that blue dot in the wiring harness? And I'm not sure, I, my camera's so close to my face it's blurry, I can't even tell if I'm focused or not. And I knocked a bunch of this, see my screwdriver, a bunch of blue fuzz coming off of it. See all the shit coming down? That's the wire I'm looking for. Gray with a blue stripe, that's the broken wire. Hopefully there aren't many more up there broken with it, but... Somehow I gotta get up in there, or tear my compressor out and then uh, get up in there. And repair that one wire because that's the one that has given me the code for my right rear strut. And the funny part is the right rear strut still pumps up. In fact, the whole rear pumps up. I'm going to pause here. The whole rear pumps up. And what I'm looking for is this N151 right here is the code that I have. Blue with gray. Gray and blue. Gray, gray wire with a blue stripe. That's one of my struts. So it goes N148, uh, 149 for the front, 151 and 150 for the rear. And uh, I'll be damned. I did not think a wire would break like that, but apparently the weather got to it and that's the wire that uh, broke off. Oh yeah, the funny part, the rear still works. The front is slammed to the ground. I can't get the front to pump up. And there's no codes for the front, but we'll continue this series uh, when I find out if that fixes it or not. Thank you. Hope this helps. Ask questions if you need.